Hey guys, so I wanted to talk to you guys about something that's pretty important and personal to me. Uh, this is going to be a giveaway video, uh, but just it's going to be a little different, so just bear with me one second. So when I was younger, as most of you guys know, I was a dancer my entire life. I started at Showtime Dance Studio, which was in Longwood, Florida. I danced there until I was nine years old. I started dancing there when I was 16 months old, and the owner, Kathy Gillespie, she was also my mother's dance teacher, and she was super close to me, my family. She used to, she was basically my second mother. She took me everywhere. She just, such an amazing human being and Christian woman, and so I danced with her for about eight years. Um, she was my role model, my idol. I would go sleep at her house, take care of her dog, play with her smoothie machine, and like I was there every single night. So when I was eight years old, I got a phone call how she was diagnosed with breast cancer. We didn't, we were so young to process this stuff, so we didn't really know what it was happening. And um, after two long years, um, she, sorry. And after two long years of fighting, uh, going through all the chemotherapy, the radiation, all the treatment and all that, we actually lost her to breast cancer. Um, just six short months after, I was at a new studio with Deborah Barnes and she was like the whole like mother figure. She sculpted me into everything I am today. Uh, she sculpted me into everything I am today as a person, um, my drive for everything. She was just that hardcore person in my life. And it's a huge switch from like a Christian studio to Deborah Barnes, who if everyone like who knows Deborah Barnes knows exactly how she was. Uh, she also didn't like many pictures, so that's all I have of her. Um, and that was actually the day that she came up to me and said, Logan, I'm not as bad as Kathy Gillespie was, and I just knew it straight from then. I had such anger. I don't know if I was mad at her. I don't know who I was mad at. I was just like, are you kidding me? Yeah, nine months after she went through the whole chemotherapy and all of that treatment and stuff and was still strong as could be and still running around screaming at people. Yeah, she used to put tacks under our heels so we couldn't come down from Releve. She used to put a lighter under our legs so we couldn't let our legs fall down. And us as kids, we used to suck on our lips when we were dancing as like a nervous twitch. And so she'd put cod liver oil on our lips so we wouldn't suck our lips. She was super hardcore like that, but she was family to me and super close with me. I used to sleep over her house. And the day I was actually going over to her house to swim in her pool, we got a phone call and there were complications uh, and she had a blood clot due to complications of the breast cancer and the chemotherapy and the treatment and all that stuff. So I just wanted to reach out to you guys because I know, I mean, I have two of the closest people that I could ever think of in my life were lost to breast cancer. Look at Miseraka Racing and Fortress Water are partnering up and we are going to do a care package giveaway, uh, three care packages to breast cancer survivors or breast cancer people who are suffering from breast cancer right now, just as a way to give back. Uh, this care package is gonna have Fortress Water in it, of course, um, some other extra things, some hero cards, some Logan Miseraka Racing stuff, and some extra uh, necessities that would help you guys as you guys are going through this. So I just wanted to reach out to you guys and share my side of the story. I'd love to hear you guys if you or a loved one is suffering or a survivor of breast cancer. Uh, if you could just share your comments down below of this. So to enter into this giveaway, just like, share, comment down below, um, either message me if you don't feel uh, comfortable announcing this, but uh, if you for, or a loved one is a cancer survivor currently, diagnosed with breast cancer right now. Uh, we will be entering you guys into the giveaway and giving away three care packages. Thank you guys for listening. I just wanted to share that with you guys so you guys feel comfortable sharing anything with me that you may want to talk about. So I love you and I will see you guys at the end of the week for the giveaway announcement. <laughs>